Our World Cup journey in Qatar continues, but for how much longer? Welcome back, guys, to Son of Scotland 90. It's the FIFA 23 World Cup playthrough with Qatar 2022. We are playing as Japan. We're trying to get to the group stages. We've left it late. We lost to Germany. We bounced back with a win against Costa Rica. But unfortunately, it looks like we're going to have to beat Spain if we want to get through and out of the group stages. You can see that we are... A point behind both Spain and Germany. Germany are set to take on Costa Rica. And we're set to take on Spain. So the only way we can really go through with a draw would be if Costa Rica beat Germany by a couple of goals. I don't see that happening. So it looks like the maths is pretty simple for us. It's an easy equation. Beat Spain and we're into the knockout stages of the World Cup. Don't beat Spain and we're going home. There you go. Can't make it much easier than that. With that said, guys, let's go, let's do it, let's get into the game. Let's try and get Japan out of the group stage and in to the knockout rounds. All right, here we go then. This is it, Spain versus Japan. We have to win. We win, we go through with Japan. We do not win, we do not go through. Uh, can't make it much easier than that. There we go, the players lining up, ready to sing the Japanese national anthem. I've no idea what it is, so I'm not going to insult anybody by pretending to sing it by just doing a lot of... Uh, Japanese talk, but the Japanese fans look up for it, even though half of those people look you know, like normal white people. Where's the Asians? God damn it. That's something that annoys me. You'd, you'd think at least with the FIFA, at least with the game, like, for, like, African countries, they could at least get, like, you know, majority black people, and European countries get majority white people, and, like, for the Asian countries, get people that are, actually look Asian. Uh, but they don't seem to do that. Anyway, here's our team. Gonda, Nakatomo, Yoshida, Taniguchi, Tomiyase, Morita, Tanaka. In midfield, they've got Minamino, Kamada, and Ito. And up front, it is going to be Asano. We've decided to go with Asano over Maeda. Could that come back and haunt us? It might. I don't know. Maeda's got pace. I like Maeda. He's a good player. He's fast, he runs, he's got an engine, he never stops running, I mean, he's like the energizer buddy, the guy can, you just put him up front, man, he just doesn't stop, you know, he goes and goes and goes, so, he does offer us something, but I'm thinking if we can maybe have Maeda to come on late and tire out the Spanish defenders with his fresh legs, and that could also work to our advantage, but Spain are going with Simon and Nets, still mad that David De Gea never got picked for this, uh, Gea, Torres, Laporte, Carafal, they've got Koke, Bus Busquets and Lorente in midfield. And the front three for Spain is Olmo, Morata. And I didn't even see the last guy, but it doesn't matter. Here we go. It's Spain versus Japan. Oh, no. Sarabia. Oh, he's, he's intercepted by Morita. That's good stuff. Ball out to Minamino. Minamino looking for, looking for anyone. He's going to try and find Ito. Ito. First time touch. Trying to play it through to Tanaka. But the pass needed to be slightly better. I do not like these colours of the kits. Definitely too close for my liking. Especially if you're blind and colour blind like I am. Then I mean, all I can see is a sea of blue here. It's 22 blue shots. Include well, not including the goalkeeper shots. But you get my point, right? Kamada, what can he do? What can he do? He's looking for Morita. Morita, oh, jumping, <laughs> a jumping folly. I tell you what, he's actually won himself a free kick here. Looks like the referees give a handball. And it's going to be Minamino then with an opportunity to take this. Spain have got someone ducking underneath the wall. We're going over the wall! And it's just over the bar as well. So, so close. Incredibly close. But uh, not close enough there for Minamino. But uh, yeah, that wasn't far away at all. Oh no. Torres gets away from the man. It's Morata. Morata just runs into danger. Tanaka though gives it away and it's back to Japan. And we've gave it away again, man. We just cannot seem to hold on to the ball for any sort of length of time here, ball played it to Olmo, it's Lorente and it's a good interception there, Yoshida gets across, takes it now it's Taniguchi, come on Taniguchi let's do something, well, don't be doing that that's the last thing you need to do, it's back to Morata, Morata oh no, oh he could have went down he decided to stay on his feet, I can't believe that a Spaniard that didn't fucking dive oh no that one's dove, oh and they get the penalty man, for what? That's, an, that's absolutely unbelievable. I was just about to praise him there for not diving. And then we see arguably the biggest dive of all fucking time. I mean, look at that. I mean, he's, he's, the guy gets out of the screen. He's not even on screen by the time he decides to dive. This is a joke. This is a travesty. It's going to be Maratha versus Gonda. Oh, what a save for Gonda. Cheaters never win. Cheaters never win. And that's exactly 
what Spain did there. They cheat it, but thankfully we saved the penalty. Oh my god. He's, he's the one another corner, but they absolutely done us in with that wee uh, pearlette spin. Saribia then. Short ball. Oh my, oh no, it's another penalty. In that time we've completely wiped him out. It wasn't a dive, I'll admit. The only dive was the Japanese player going straight into him. Look at that, that's a horrendous tackle there. Two foots him. And can we make another save? Marata feels he's gone down again. Oh god, Marata goes the same way. Ah, he's tricked us. He's went the same way. I thought he was going to go the opposite way. But no, he put it down low. Past our right hand side in Spain do have the lead, so yeah, Spain <laughs> with the winning, could that be the winning penalty, maybe? Asano, Morita, out to Minamino, Minamino cutting inside, that's good for Minamino, Minamino, shot, block, oh, high boot, high boot, penalty for us, doesn't look like it, oh no, it's off the post, it's just too wide of the post, and we're still in it, just Spain are celebrating, it's not, a, no, it's not another goal though, but they're in front, they're in control, and they could have easily had went 2-0 up there, man. We've been fortunate, we've got away with one, that's a good tackle. Plays it straight to Tanaka, and now can Japan be on the attack here before half time? We're looking for Asana, Asana was trying to get to that, and he cannot get to the long legs of the Spanish defender. Stops us, and that is it, half time, we're 1-0 we're down, we need to win this, so we need to find two goals somewhere in this second half. Well, Costa Rica's thrown with Germany, so you never know. If Costa Rica can take the lead in that one and we draw, but we need Costa Rica to win by two goals at least. So, and I don't really know how it will work on goal difference, but yeah, I mean, at the moment we can't rely on Costa Rica. We need to, we need to do it ourselves. Oh no, Olmo, it's past us again. Still Olmo again, that's a good tackle. And can we keep it in? We can actually. I could have swore that was out, it's not the, oh no. Oh, and I put it wide. So anyway, it wouldn't be the first time there was controversy with Japan and the ball being out of play. Ball in for the corner. Head of the way. Oh, it's another block. Tanaka. Morita. Ito. Here we go. Ito. Nakatomo. Ball in. Flicked on. Oh, and the keeper comes out. Simone. And grabs it. Oh, no. Oh, we need to get back, and we do get back, and it's going to go straight to the hands of Gonda. I mean, why is he climbing on the ball? Why is he landing on it, mate? We haven't got time to fucking cuddle it. We need to get it forward. Right, Taniguchi. Poor for Taniguchi. Loses out. It's Murata. Could Spain be about to put us out of misery here? Oh, no, it's close. Yes, Morita. Good interception. Here we go. Ball it to Kamada. Asano needs to make a run. He hasn't really made a run, and what the fuck is that? Oh no, we've been turned again, it's chipped and that's it, it's all over, it's good night. It's 2-0 Spain, I think we're done. We're going to bring on Dice and Maida here, but I don't think it's going to matter. Oh no, it's chipped again, it's going to be free. Fucking hell man, Spain completely chipping us. We'll be chipped at the World Cup here. They've chipped away, and it's chip after chip. Oh, it's through to Olmo again, this could be four. It really could be Omo, gets away from Taniguchi, he spins around, Taniguchi's been absolutely sent to the shops, Taniguchi slides in, Taniguchi's having a nightmare here, the keeper makes a save and it's sliding again and Spain are just messing about with us and now it is four. So they've finished the job, not content with three, they wanted to make it one, two, three, four and we don't even have time to launch a counter so yeah there you go, what a shit ending to the World Cup guys, thought we had, thought we had a chance of winning that and going through. Turns out with no chance, and Spain with a oh, I don't want to restart. Spain with a deserved win, and we're out. So there you go. Germany won their game against uh, Costa Rica, so we needed to beat Spain to go through. We didn't. I mean, we picked up a win against Costa Rica, but in the end, it wasn't enough because we lost to the two best teams in the group. No harm, no shame in losing to Spain and Germany, but it uh, it won't get us into the the, the knockout stages. So there you go. Following teams will be knocked out. Japan. We tried. We tried, guys. I failed. Tried to do it twice. Tried to get Australia out the groups. Couldn't do it. At least with Japan, though, I got to the third match day with Australia. After two games, we were officially out. So that was a bit of a mess. But, uh, yeah. Tried. Didn't really work. 
And who knows? I don't like the World Cup anyway. Fuck the World Cup. It's been a shit World Cup. Don't they want to qualify? I'm glad this shit's finished. Check out the other content on the channel, guys. FIFA 23 Hearts Career Mode, Football Manager Hearts, and all a lot of the other stuff coming soon as well. That's it, guys. Leave a like, leave a comment, subscribe, and I'll catch you in the next one. Till then, though. Peace.